Welcome to the Hard Science Explained channel, where we explore the mysteries of science and delve into the unknown. Today we're going to talk about one of the most controversial theoretical particles in the world of physics, the graviton. The graviton is a hypothetical particle that is believed to mediate the force of gravity. In other words, it's the quantum of gravity, an elementary particle that is yet to be discovered. If it exists, the graviton is expected to be massless because the gravitational force has a very long range and appears to propagate at the speed of light. The graviton must be a spin-2 boson because the source of gravitation is the stress energy tensor, which is a second order tensor. This means that if a massless spin-2 particle is discovered, it would most likely be the graviton. The way the graviton would function is very fascinating. According to quantum field theory, all fundamental forces, including gravity, can be described as the exchange of virtual particles between two objects. These virtual particles, or bosons, act as carriers of the force, transmitting it from one object to another. In the case of gravity, the exchange of virtual gravitons between two objects would cause them to attract each other. The strength of this attraction would depend on the masses of the objects and the distance between them, just as described by Isaac Newton's Law of Universal Gravitation and Albert Einstein's Theory of General Relativity. However, unlike other fundamental forces such as the strong and weak nuclear forces, the force of gravity is extremely weak, making it difficult to detect the exchange of gravitons. We will later explain in this video why gravitons are so difficult to detect and therefore considered controversial. The idea of a particle mediating the gravitational interaction was first proposed by Soviet physicists Dmitry Blokhatsev and F. M. Galperin in 1934. The term graviton was coined by them and it was later anticipated by Pierre Simon Laplace. However, the gravitons postulated by Laplace were not connected to quantum mechanics or special relativity. One of the reasons behind the controversial nature of the graviton is that if it exists, it would be extremely difficult to detect or prove of its existence. The difficulty in detecting gravitons lies in their extremely weak interaction with other particles and their low energy compared to other known particles such as photons or electrons. To detect gravitons, a highly sensitive experimental setup is required. This includes a massive, isolated object that can generate a significant gravitational field and a detector that can measure the tiny variations in this field caused by the passage of gravitons. However, the weak interaction of gravitons with other particles means that even the largest gravitational sources Something as large as the Sun would only generate a tiny number of gravitons that could be detected by current technology. Additionally, gravitons are expected to be massless, which means that they would travel at the speed of light and would not be affected by other particles or fields in the same way as other particles. This has led to some physicists to doubt whether they exist. The lack of direct evidence for gravitons and the difficulties associated with detecting them are among the main reasons why some doubt their existence. Whether or not the graviton exists is still a mystery, but if it does, it would play a crucial role in our understanding of the universe. It would help us understand the fate of the universe and the role that gravitation plays in it. It would be the missing piece in the development of quantum gravity. Despite these challenges, the search for evidence of gravitons continues as understanding the nature of gravity is one of the biggest open questions in physics. Please subscribe to follow our discussion of this potentially game-changing framework. But what do you think? Do you believe that the graviton is real? Do you think physicists will ever prove its existence? Please leave a comment on your thoughts down below. And thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more hard science topics explained.